Alrighty, so we're going to do another test with Audacity, playing around with the NPU. Uh, I've got OpenVINO's AI extension enabled here. Let's go ahead and generate some music. So using a prompt 80s pop track with bassy drums and synth, I'm going to select my encode devices where the NPU is available. And let's see what happens with the generation of music and how that actually offloads to the NPU. Here you see the NPU is woken up. We've got some utilization there. CPU utilization initially started a little bit high, but now it's going down. So, hey, look, the NPU that's uh, available in our Intel Core Ultra processors, NPU being the dedicated AI engine, that's the neural processing unit. I've got an application, Audacity over here, running code that has been written to leverage the NPU. So that's really great to see. Uh, let's see how this clip turns out sounding. I'm pretty excited. Uh, just got to wait it out and keep going. The NPU again definitely utilized which is great to see let's uh keep playing the npu is still doing its thing you saw that it decreased slightly and then picked up all over again So it's taken about four and a half minutes for a 10 second clip that we're going to get. All done. NPU utilization went down to zero. CPU is back to normal. Let's play our clip. Pretty fascinating. If you uh, saw me on video, I'm bouncing here. <laughs> so cool. I think it's using music gen, small, floating point 16, mono, from a model perspective, and leverage the CPU and NPU, which is great to see. Prompt was 80s pop track with bassy drums and synth. Thanks so much for watching.